What's up? What's up, world? It's your partner, man. Big North. Hey, hey, hey. Today I'm back at y'all with just a little video, man. Just to show all my people that's inspired by this work, man. Whoever inspired to be a content creator, a YouTuber, whatever you want to call it, man. This is the stuff you go through, bro. You got to deal with studio gangsters. Matter of fact, you might deal with some real gangsters. You might deal with people in their feelings. You just might deal with some haters, man. Or you just going to deal with the negative type. But this is the type of stuff that go on, bro. Look at this, man. So somebody commented on one of my videos, right? So Beanie Chris may salute to Benny Chris, man, for the comment, you know. He said, I'll make it happen to you. And then he said, holla at me. You know, he just tried to say some Soldier Slim shit. But it wasn't right. But it was cool, though. I didn't bicker about it. I just said, see, woo day. Woo day. Well, you know what I mean? Keep in mind, that's Soldier Slim. It's called Woody. That's on Soldier Slim's Give It To Him Raw album. That, that, it's spelled exactly like that. So while I'm just chilling, I get a notification. And this some dude named Just I337 Representer, right? Just I337 Representer. He said, it's Wode, not Woody. So I said, he said, get it right, outsider. So the nigga just try to pick a fight with me out the blue, right? Get it right, outsider. Like, what's up with all of you? get what I'm saying? So I'm an outsider. But little did he know that Midwest is like the hub for down south. At that time, ask Master P where he was getting all his money from, man. Ask Baby Lil Wayne Island where they was getting their money from, bro. The Midwest. That includes Illinois, Michigan, Kansas City, St. Louis, Ohio, Chicago, all that, bro. But this goofy dude don't even know that. So then he say, I said, you sound crazy, little homie. Go look at the Give It To Him Raw album, then come back and apologize. So then Beanie Chris said, the internet crazy. You get what I'm saying? So now look, look, look. The nigga, somebody named Lil Mirror, he said, he talking to the Just I 337 dude, the, the, the New Orleans dude who ain't even from New, I mean, the Louis, Louisiana dude who ain't even from New Orleans, bruh. But he said, you must be a little boy with that comment, which was very funny, man. You get what I'm saying? The comment was very funny. Now, look, this how you... Look, dude was trying to troll and be super gangster, but now he gets triggered. You know, we done reversed the role on him. So he said, nah, I ain't no little boy. I'm 38, approaching 39 from down here. Born and raised. You get what I'm saying? Man, I don't even want to go through this whole thread, man, but you get what I'm saying, man? It's always somebody that's going to try to throw you off your rocker, man. You get what I'm saying? I had to tell him, like, bruh, I ain't going to be on here discussing my age, but nigga, you was a little nigga. So when Give It To Him Raw came out, you was 11 years old, bro. You 11 years old, nigga. I was thugging. I was in the streets, nigga. That's why I saw the Slim was my favorite rapper because I felt everything he was saying. I was on that same type of time. But it's a little nigga that was 11 years old at that time. Tell him, man, you can't make this up, man. Anyway, this is for all my YouTuber upcomings, all everybody that's working on a craft. This is the stuff you got to look out for. Internet gangsters, internet trolls, man. But you know it don't work, man. You get what I'm saying? Look, y'all see that. Yeah, man, you can't play a Midwest nigga like you want to tune. If y'all didn't know, BG, Soldier Slim, the Chopper City Boys, all of them was in the Midwest, man. Juvenile, all in BG, they was in Dayton, Ohio, particularly. You get what I'm saying? Around 2000, them niggas was in up here. 
They was in, I got niggas, my Detroit niggas said they was in the chilling with Soldier Slim. You get what I'm saying? Chilling with BG. This little nigga ain't even from New Orleans. He's somewhere far as hell talking about Walt A. Like, come on, bro. So look. Look at this little look look at this fluky shit. I am a part of it being from Louisiana growing up on it way before they made mainstream. You get what I'm saying? Y'all read that man. Was all in the clubs down here. Nigga, you eleven. How you gonna be all in the club, man? Get that together. Now look, hold up. Hold up, hold up. I'm about to go to where he go crazy. Here we go. I don't need to do nothing. Your Midwest behind ain't from the boot. I know all about everything from down here. And watch who you try to play before you find yourself one day. No, hold on. Before you find yourself he meant to say on an obituary, but he put one on an obituary <laughs> one day. Because you got the wrong type of car, for sure. Plus, don't youngster me when I'm a 40-year-old. 40 and a half from 40. Man, listen, bro. This nigga just told me he going to put me on a bitch of obituary, cuz. Man, you can't make this up, man. So, you know, I had to call him a comedian, man. You get what I'm saying? It's comedians around here, man. So, that's the, I mean, the hard part is getting content. But, you know, people make content for you. Like, this right here is very good content, man. Just This is like educational purposes, man. This is educational purpose content, bro. You get what I'm saying? I'm just trying to educate y'all what comes with this. And then, you know, you know it's always going to be a hater. But as long as you carry yourself right, respect others, man, and, and stay true to the game, man, you'll be all right, man. With that being said, man, it's your partner, man. Big North, man. I'm signing out, man. Make sure y'all like and subscribe. Hey, man. Go ahead and load up the comments on this Custer. Uh, just I3. Now, I ain't even gonna call him a Custer, man. Because I really appreciate him. You know, he you know, he running it up, man. I appreciate him for real. But at the same time, he do need a little, little spanking, man. He need a little G-check, man. You know, somebody get his mind right, man. Y'all go tell that nigga, man, quit acting like a custer in the comments. If y'all want to know what uh what video this is, man, it's this one right here, man. So I was running for that, so they went to bang and bang. I seen the K-Logo black hat, it could better dip it with the man. Anyway, you got two on the real, man. You came in.